Tesla S. This is our driver, John. What's that? <laughs> so what's the story behind the Uber? Driving the Tesla. Why am I doing that? Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, let's see. Because I uh, need an excuse to drive my Tesla. <laughs> oh. And uh, meet interesting people, so it's not like real work. Well, as, 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 as the question behind that is really, you know, you, you don't really make any money doing this, so why, why, why would you do it? Yes. You know, uh, why would you drive such a nice car doing something that you don't make money doing? Uh, and, and that's so that's that. You know, you, it's it's fun. It's I need to get get more time on Tesla. I just enjoy. It. I don't have enough excuse to to drive it. And, uh, I won't, Meet cool people all the time. Most people are pretty cool, you know, interesting people. And uh, I, I, I like I like to meet interesting people. It's kind of being at like a, a like at a bar, but you, except you can't drink, you know. Any more questions? No, this is good. Good. So you enjoying your your car? Yes, tremendously. It is the car of all cars. Magnificently designed, isn't it? You can feel the power. Yes, instant torque. I have uh, a newer Tesla, and it'll drive itself in autopilot. Not this one, but the, the new one. And that's uh, that's another reason. It's just you know, you get to. Play with new technology. You know, Ford recently just bought a uh, a Tesla for two hundred thousand dollars. They pay way over sticker price, so they can reverse engineer it. Wow! So they think of it. You know, they uh, they they admire it enough to say, "Hey, we gotta do something like this." I think the uh, BMW has a uh, they have a fully electric, it's called i3, mm -hmm. uh, it's a funky looking car, uh, you know, you just have to have the right taste for it, but it, it looks, uh, you have to get used to the look, it's not... So what year is this? Uh, this is 2013. 2013. Now, uh, the BMW, they also have one that's really beautiful, it's an i8, and that it's a hybrid. It's a beautiful car, it, but, um, but it only gets 27 miles per gallon, which kind of defeats the purpose of a hybrid. Um, I guess you still benefit from the you know, high torque, quick response of a hybrid, uh, but you know, obviously you can't really compete with Tesla if you, if you do that. So, not too many people. You, you won't see that many I8 on the freeway. It's a nice car. Just a little bit of history. Um, at the beginning, Tesla tried to work with BMW. And um, BMW wanted to have a certain form that they liked to, to, to have. And uh, Elon Musk said, this is not aerodynamic. It's got terrible drag. Uh, and we can't have this. This, this car needs to, you know, needs to be extremely aerodynamic. Um, you know, he, he's a physic. He study physics. You know, that's what's just, and uh, he's just not going to put up with bad aerodynamics. So they, they they split up. So they could have had a partnership, but they just couldn't see eye to eye. So how does your battery life uh, sustain throughout the day? Do you have to charge it or does it charge itself? Uh, it probably charge once a week. Once a week? Yeah. Um, depends on how you drive. If you drive crazy, it'll drain it faster. Mm -hmm. But, you know, nowadays Tesla's, you know, they go anywhere from 230 to uh, 290 miles. 
and that that's pretty good. I mean, I'm actually going to drive to uh, Yosemite this Memorial weekend, mm -hmm. and uh, I can on one charge I can go there and come back. So, but they they actually have a bunch of superchargers at Yosemite now. So you they do okay. yeah, and so you so you can just. Go there and like a lot of these hotels, like the Awani Hotel, is that famous right in the valley, at Yosemite Valley. They they have a, they have a Tesla charger there, several. And so um, I'm staying one at the Grove Groveland Hotel, and that has a Tesla charger also. So so it's it's nice because you know they're trying to encourage you know clean uh, clean cars up there for. Uh, it's quiet, you want to hear the birds, you don't want to hear, you want to smell nature, you know. That's the future. Yeah. Alright, so you guys are VIP right over here, right? Showing up in style. Yep, awesome. Thank you very much. It was Thank you very much. Ride. You're welcome. Yeah. You guys have a good day. You too. Nice meeting you. What do you guys do? Uh, computers, databases, okay. tech -y stuff. IT stuff. <laughs> See you around. Yeah.